Good evening. Hello, hello, guys. Let's see. Carlos Antonio, how are you? Hello, teacher. I'm good. Thank you for asking me. Just let me collect yes. my earphones. No problem. Yeah. How are you? How are you today? How was your day? Oh, everything's fine, just fine, you know. Mm -hmm. You know, same old story. Let's see, I went to work and, oh, I went to the gym. I had a couple Something of... new that you can share? Yeah, I went to the gym today. Oh, the gym? Yeah, I went to the gym. I had the chance to go, so I took advantage of it. That's good. You want to be on shape with your body. Well, actually, it's more a matter of health, you know, it's necessary. Okay. Because, I mean, at my age, you got to take care of those little details. What details about you? What? How's everything? Little details like going to the gym. I mean, mm -hmm. it's necessary to exercise for your health. Yeah. So I went today, did a couple of, of muscles, and it was okay. I mean, it was okay. I was practicing and and how fun. I mean, I enjoy that. It's good for getting rid of some stress. What about you? How was your day? How okay. was everything? Same as always, I went to work. I did a lot of activities at my work. And I come back home and now I am here ready for the class. By I the way, came. I've been, I came. Yeah, I home. came back home. I came at home. Okay, that's nice. What time did you get home? Around 4 and 30 p.m. 4.30, oh, it's okay, it's early. Yeah, because my home, my, my work is so close to my house. It's two blocks from house. Two blocks? Yeah, it's so close. And you are so lucky. I go my I go to my I go to my work by bicycle. Yeah, you are a lucky guy, man. Two blocks from home. I know. That's cool. Yeah, it's so close. I I can go walking, but sometimes I am lazy. And I and I like to go by bicycle. Yeah, because that's quite close. Yeah, it is. That's nice. I mean, to be able to. So that's why you can be early at home, relax. I enjoy my breakfast because I can come back to my house and I. Uh, I can save money in that way. Yeah, of course. Of course, that's great. I mean, the fact that you're able to, to, to be home early, to enjoy your food calmly, I mean, that's nice. Yeah, it is. Well, mister, welcome to the class. Nice having you here. Okay, it's a pleasure. Thank you. A uh, pleasure all mine. Let's see. Luis Abrego, hello. Good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. Very well, teacher. With a lot of work. 
Hey, how's everything? How was your day? Uh, um, I was uh, accounting. I work in taxes. Yeah, yeah, but, oh, so you were doing taxes. I was doing tax. Uh, Eva. You, you say it, no, you say it like this. Lo dice de esta manera. I was doing taxes. I was doing, I, I was doing taxes. I what? I was, I was doing taxes. Okay. Wow. Yes. It's a lot of work, I imagine. Yes. Yes, did you? Yeah, but I mean, that's life, you know. The good thing is that you understand that. And I mean, it's your area. Right? Yes, right, did you? And that's something very important when you're working on your area so you can like, like uh, yeah. you feel like you are fulfilling something. I mean, it's different when you're working in something that is not your area. That, that's more difficult. Yes, it's, it's, it's a little complicated and de, de, delicado, como se dice, delicado. Delicate, it's delicate. Delicate, delicate. Okay, well, Luis, welcome to the class. Thank you, thank you, teacher. Okay. Let's see who else is around. Orlando, hello, how are you? Hi, teacher. I can't complain. I'm good. I can't complain. That's cool. That's a good attitude. So, how's everything? How was the day for you? Uh, same routine. Uh, kind of normal with the same job routine. But Yesterday, I had the opportunity to talk with my friend, and we practiced a little bit some job questions, job interview question about tell me about yourself and all that things. Oh, and at the cool. end, at the end, uh, he gave me uh, some feedback, and he told me that I'm improving on the language oh. but i need yeah of course yeah, it shows i need to learn more vocabulary and that's it he told me and i trust yeah. in him because he's him. a native speaker ah thank you yeah. i trust him yeah of course i mean uh, when you are in this level mostly that's what you need uh, more vocabulary and of course grammar comes handy but there it's always something else something else oh so nice yeah and right now so nice. uh, yes 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 tell me go ahead go ahead no tell me tell me tell me please no i'm, I'm right now i'm just uh looking for some let me see what else what is uh the tenses because i want to reforzar and how to say that rainforest 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 that part yeah, about, yeah. about the past and the future don't worry thing. don't worry don't worry let me just take notes because i got you for monday right yeah you told me it's uh, 14 okay yeah we will get that we will get to that don't worry okay we will get to that i have some resources that will become handy for you well oh, thank, Orlando, you. thank you and welcome thank you so much okay guys give me just one second Okay, I am back. I am back. 
Antonio Rodas, hello, good evening, how are you? Good evening, teacher, I'm fine. Okay, how's everything? How was the day? Same old story? Yes, teacher, yes, teacher the same story. The, the difference that today I don't, I don't have overtime. I, I, I go back to home early. Five, I, I came six. back home. Yes, I, I came, came back, back home. Oh, five thirty. That's nice. Yes, teacher. But the last, the, the last week, I worked all, all week, or every, every, every day on the of the week until is five or fifteen to six. Oh, very late. Yes, teacher. It was hard those days, I imagine. Very hard, teacher. And I, I, I think this, this week, uh, I don't, I don't have overtime. Let's hope so, so you can rest a little bit. It's necessary. Yes, it's necessary, teacher. That's nice. That's nice. Well, and tell me, what about uh, when it comes, because we are getting to the days that are very heavy in some companies, I mean, November, December, how are those days in your company? Are they heavier than usual or normal? No, teacher, always is, is heavy, always, every day, and also November and December, uh, will we have a lot of work. This this year is uh, is very different than the the another years because the the another years uh, for this this month we don't have we don't have a uh, overtime. Oh, usually this time of the year there's no overtime. Yes, teacher. usually usually at this time of the year. You say it like that. Usually at this time of the year, okay. there's okay, no teacher. overtime. This, that's not. There's, there's, let there. me text it for you. Okay, thank you. Oops, I'm sorry, there's a mistake there. Ah, okay, there's like no. Like this, there, there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, overtime is good because it, it's extra money, of course, right? But I mean, it's very demanding. Yes, sir, it's necessary. It's, it's a little, a little hard to do overtime, but it's necessary too. Yeah, because I mean, it's, it's extra money. Yeah, and the dollars are always welcome. Yes, of course, teacher. Yeah, but as I was telling you, sometimes it's very demanding and you end up like very tired, right? Yes, it's very tiring. Well, awesome. Welcome. Nice talking to you. Thank you, teacher. Ah, thanks to you. Let's see. Uh, uh, um. Hey, Francisco, how are you? Hey, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you, my friend? Uh, I believe that day was great. It was a full work, but Oh, nice, I believe nice. Okay, that's a good attitude, I like that. It was full of uh, your job, but you had a lot of obligations, but it was okay. It's so, so, it's necessary. Nice to hear it. 
What? It's nice to hear it. Qué bueno escucharlo. Okay. Yeah, because I mean, as you said, some days are hard, but you know that it's it's part of the job. I mean, that happens. Yes. And the good thing is that you got the attitude because that's very important. The attitude you get towards the job. I mean, it's yes. a big, it's a big influence to have a good attitude. And the morning, how the the good attitude, but in the mm -hmm. afternoon. Yeah, it's different. Yeah, I understand you totally. Yes. For me, mornings, I'm always like with a lot of energy. There's a part of, of the afternoon, like between 2 and 3 p.m. that I'm like, oh, I don't want to do nothing. Yes, and sometimes I drop off in the office. <laughs> oh, well, that's good. You got that opportunity. Is it really and, that, and that you can take a nap. In my case, I cannot take naps. I'm not able to take naps. I mean, um, I don't do it. It's just that I don't feel good taking naps. Okay. Well, Mister, welcome to the class. Nice thank having you. you here. No, oh, thank <clears throat> you. Let's see who else is around. Hey, Magdalena, how are you? Hello, teacher. Um, I am arriving at home. Just, just arriving arrived. home? Yeah, wow. just arrived. Mm -hmm. oh. Today today we had a worship. Worship oh. of mid midweek. Oh, really? Yep. What's the schedule for that worship? Mm, it is uh, first with... Um, uh, we open the worship with a pray, and then we uh, um, we have uh, uh, a, a couple of sing of songs, a couple of songs, and then um, the biblic lecture. The lecture is right. Yeah. Okay. The biblic lecture is well. Is, no uh, reading, reading because a lecture is could be like a regan. Ah, uh, okay. And then the reading, biblical reading, and um, it's a, a capture uh, every service. And then is uh, other two songs, and after that, the potential um, no. The preacher. Okay, the preach. The preach. Yeah. The preaching. The preaching. Uh -huh, the preaching. Okay, the preaching, and after the preaching, we we pick up the the offerings, the offers. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Pick up the offers and pray to to end uh, to finish and pray to finish the service. And this is one one hour and a half. So it starts what? 6.30 or 6? Six? 6.30. Wow. So it's, well, it's nice. How many times do you meet uh, during the week? Uh, how many times, what? Do you meet the reunion during the week? Um, uh, three times uh, on with on Wednesday, on Friday, and on Sundays. Wednesday, Fridays, and Sundays. Oh, okay, well, uh -huh. three, uh, three, three times, times at a week. Uh, three times a week. Three times a week. Perfect. <laughs> Is that no? That's nice. Thank you. Yeah, nice having you. Hey, thanks, teacher. Let's see. Ingrid, hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. I am tired. Oh. 
<laughs> Why? Why are you tired? I'll try to open the door. Mm, I don't remember. <laughs> How was the day? A heavy day at work? Yes, I was a uh, very hard. Uh, it day. was. It was. It was, was hard. Uh, no, hard. Um, um, I don't know. This the today is work. Yesterday, um, and and Monday, <laughs> all week. Every day, the whole week. Yes, maybe um, um, tomorrow too, and Friday too. <laughs> Gosh, like yes, every day. But yes, but I change the work. Is I have the the new routine. Ah. Hmm. Yes, yeah, sometimes it takes time to adapt to a new routine, right? Excuse me? Sometimes it takes time to adapt to a new routine. Yes, teacher. I need time. <laughs> Give me just a second. Like this. Sometimes it takes time to adapt to a new routine. Okay, sometimes I take it. It 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 takes time to adapt to a new routine. Yeah, it happens. It happens more. So yes. now I said, and today you I am sure you make double sure that you have the kids, right? I don't know. I don't understand the final. Today, today, I I am sure you make you double check that you have the keys. Ah yes, <laughs> yes, teacher. Yeah. I don't know yes. what happened yesterday, teacher. Did happen? Didn't happen. Okay, but you found them. No. No. Oops. No. I don't know. Yeah, you have to you have to call the locksmith. Yes. And yes. well, I hope you have spared. Pero que te mido request. Yes, but the the other keys. Keys. Uh, keys. <laughs> the other keys, and I need. Uh, or oh, I go to the duplicator, but yeah, for yeah, me, you, you, mm -hmm. you need you need to make copies. Yes, but I I lost two two copies yesterday. I don't know what. Yes, Come on, Ingrid. I don't know. <laughs> A saber. Yeah. Si yeah, you're in love. That's why. Yes, teacher. That's but why you're in love. Today, finally, at home. <laughs> okay, well, yeah. nice having you here, Ingrid. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Carla. Hello, Carla. Hello, teacher. How are you? Also oh, elegant, Carla. Where are you going after the class? Thank you. Where are you going after the class? Para dónde va después, no? Tell us, Anita. tell us. Anita, Anita. <laughs> I am sleeping. Oh, you are just arriving from work. Yes, uh, my mm. day was so good. Um, I was super busy and I day afternoon super ocupada. Oh, uh, I was pretty busy. Ah, uh, pretty busy. Um, um, 
eh, afternoon I was um, estaba durmiendo. Really? Yes. You were falling asleep? Um no. I was falling asleep like this. I was I was falling asleep. I was falling asleep. Me estaba um, durmiendo. Yes. Okay, well, don't fall asleep in my class, okay? Don't fall asleep okay. on the class. Okay. Thank you, Carla. Welcome. Thank you. Rosalina, how are you doing? How's your trot? Doing better? Hi. Hello, teacher. Yes. No. Today, not that much better. No, not much better, but <laughs> today I stay in my house. Oh, no. okay. Yeah, because if no, maybe no. No me recupero. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you cannot get better. Yeah, and you need, yeah. you need to rest a little bit. Yes. Oh, and the problem is the dust, right? They are working. The dust so, is a big problem. El polvo es muy problemático. They are in construction, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I only, uh, uh, um, my phone, sound and sound and sound and ask some. And then it's the same, but I stay in my house. <laughs> I yeah. saw, I saw the movies today. Yesterday talking about uh, <coughs> Carlos, uh, he said, uh, he improved the English when we saw the cartoons movie. And then yeah. today I saw Kung Fu oh, Panda. No, I was watching or I, I watched? Was, I watched Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> okay. <laughs> One or two. I, I understand a lot. Uh, some words, nothing for me, but for, um, como se dice, for relation. <coughs> Yeah, out of context, for context. Yeah. And then it's a good, uh, um, it's a, it's a yeah. good for us to try. Yeah, to... it's a good exercise, actually. Yes. <coughs> mm -hmm. But it's funny, movies. <laughs> okay. Rest your throat, rest your throat. Thank you, Rosalina. Yeah. Welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. Hey, Wilfredo. Hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hello, mister. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Okay, how's everything? How's the job? What, teacher? How's everything? You home or you over there somewhere? Um, are you home? Is that in casa or somewhere yeah, yes. else? Yes. Oh, that's nice. I am home. You haven't had to work out of San Salvador. Yes, teacher. No le ha tocado viajar. No, teacher, no. Okay, that's nice, right? When? Well, Wilfredo, welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. Jose Ortiz, hello, how are you, mister? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Okay. Thank you. Jose. Thank you. Also, wait a second. I have forgotten the attendance. Let me get it. Okay. okay. Let me get the attendance. Let's see. Carlos Antonio Serrano Arias. Present teacher. Okay. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Marmon. Thank you. Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo, Gabriel Beltrán Pérez, Gustavo Javier Ramírez Carrán, Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molino, Present teacher, Ivan Petrovich Guzmán Aquino, Juan Saúl Girón Sánchez, Present. Josué Rodrigo Ortiz Montarrosa. Uh, 
Juan Francisco Echarla Montano. Present. Carla Lisbeth García Lemos. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present. Luis Mario Criollo Guerrero. Present teacher. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Here I am, teacher. Thank you. Present. Present teacher. Thank you. Nelson Antonio Arrodas Rosales. Present teacher. Orlando Francisco Núñez. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Thank you, Oscar. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Vilma, Vilma Yesenia Alvarenga. Wilfredo Areval Ortiz. Present teacher. Xiomara Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Ivania Chamile Domínguez Hernández. Mardon Jonathan Gutiérrez Quirón. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see. Let me check on something. Okay, let's see who else, who else, who else. With Mario, I, oh, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Everything's good. Only yeah, today it was a, a bit, bit tired. Really? Yeah, it's in on anything, the middle. Anything on the middle, special on the week? Uh well, um, I was solving problems and trying to to not to stress myself with that. But oh. everything is good. Well, that's nice to hear it. Yeah, I need vacation, teacher. <laughs> everybody needs. Everybody needs. Yeah. Okay. I hope to to yeah, tell me. To, to travel to Guatemala in December. Oh really? For vacation? Yeah. yeah. My vacations are only in are only in holidays. Oh. Yeah. On December, it's uh, about around uh, final or, or the end of the year, right? In April or May, no, March or May. No, 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 no. May or April is for Holy Week. Yeah, Easter. And yeah, and uh, August is for holidays too. Okay, well, that's nice. Yeah. Have you gone to Guatemala before? Yeah, yeah, I so excited for that. Okay. I I want to to know or visit new places in Guatemala. Oh, that's that's nice. Tikal, for, for example. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. Tikal is beautiful. Do you know that? Yeah. Yeah, nice. I mean, yeah, it's very nice. It's so far from here, right? By a, by a car. Yeah. Driving it's, is very difficult. It's, it's uh, 
around two two days to to get there, right? Yeah, I mean driving. Oh, well, if you enjoy driving, it's okay. For me, it's my favorite hobby. <laughs> okay, then no problem. <laughs> okay, nice. Okay, thank you very much, Mr. You're welcome. Thank you to you. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. <laughs> I still got time. So we're going to have a little bit of conversation, but not just with me, okay? I'm going to send you the working groups and today we are going to... Okay. Okay. Today we are going to be very deep. Okay, we're going to talk about something deeper, something interesting, actually. Let me see. I'm going to share in the group the questions. And uh, I share them in the group, and I'm going to share them right here. So you can get them. And they are these. What are the characteristics of a good consultor? Is it necessary to have shared the same experience? Is it important to be an expert? Is it important to be patient? Okay, if you are going to, to, to help someone, if you are going to give advice to a person, when you give advice, you become a counselor, a consejero, okay? Is it necessary to have shared the same experience? Or what characteristics, first, what are, what are characteristics of a good counselor? You can say like, oh, to be a good listener, first, right? You need to really, really wait to uh, let people listen and, and guide them toward the answer something. But don't let be me the one who answers the questions. You are going to answer them. I'm going to give you just four minutes because we are going to be discussing. I'm going to be throwing the questions all around you guys. So let me get the group ready so you can go and discuss a little bit. And say groups are created. Let's do it. Okay, let's go check the groups. No. Okay, what do you bring? Um, I don't know. 
Only invent. Um, Just invent. Okay. Do you understand the questions, Carla? What are characteristic of a good consoler? Consoler? Consoler. 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 Okay, what are characteristics of a good consoler? A person mm. who, who give advice. Well, you know, Carla, that's exactly in the details of Magdaleno's job. That's part of the description of his job. Es parte de la descripción del trabajo de Magdaleno. Ask him. You ask him because that's what he does in his job every day. Okay. So you can ask him. <laughs> oh, like no, a... no, no. When, when okay. you when you say to the other people uh, good good work um, uh -huh. similar a uh, consejero or yes okay when you give uh, advice for another person right yes yeah. mm -hmm. exactly for okay, me nice. the ca the characters of a good consejero is a uh, at good how do you say a uh, Escucha o ¿sí? listen, 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 but is uh, for uh, yes, but teacher, I confuse with the 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 traducción o oh, I don't know, eh, o sea, no solo escuchar, pero el hecho que como cuando uno le dicen, ah, es que sos un, un buen escucha, sí, un buen una persona, a good listener, yes, a good listener. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. For me, this is uh, a characteristic. For you, uh, Luis Mario? It's, um, yeah, uh, a good listener is uh, uh, one, one of the characteristics. To be a good listener. To be a good listener. To be a good listener. Oh, okay. But, Truth, um, um, how to say? Sincerely, Luis? I'm sorry? Uh, confi how to say uh, confiable? Trustful, trustful. Trustful, okay. Trustful. Okay, to be a trustful is a, a good for, for, for be a counselor. Yeah, okay. Uh, Ingrid, are you a good consoler? Uh, yes. <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> you know, Ingrid, the one who said, ah, don't worry about it. It will pass. Mm, yes, no. <laughs> no, teacher. Ingrid says, don't cry. Don't cry. Don't be a kid. <laughs> and Luis Mario, uh, it's necessary to have shared the same experience, same experience. Yeah, I think that is correct because we need to know what what we what we can say and and in that situation, right? When you are uh, give ad advice to another person, you need to know that situation. So the experience is uh, it's necessary to, to think in, in that person or, or in that situation and give a good advice. Mm, for me, it's not necessary because uh, whatever people Say good uh, counselor um, is not necessary uh, to uh, have experience. To have experience, but uh, it's only necessary the 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 you have good listener listener. 
reasoning. Oh, to be a good listener. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I I understand. I understand you, but my point is about how can you um, advise or do you comfort? Ah, okay. Um, how how can how can you comfort someone if you have never uh, experienced that? Okay. Uh, I think the when people same experience the situation or how do you say consejo? Advice. Advice. The the advice is is similar to your experience, but uh, a you experience, not the exper the experience the, the the other person. And how do you say? Entonces el consejo está como cegado. Okay, then the advice has a bias. Ah, uh, okay, a bias. The advice has a bias. Bias. No lo puede escribir, teacher. I just feel, my dear. Ya lo hice. Okay, thank you. Uh, this is this is my my oh my opinion, but I don't know. Yeah, don't worry. I I understand. And and also I think that sometimes the the company is a no, is patient. Ah, okay. Um, in the other question is, um, it's important to be an expert. I think no. 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 I I agree with you <laughs> in that uh, question. <laughs> yes. It's important to be pi pi patient, 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 patient. patient. Yes. Yes. I, think, I think that is necessary because yes, more. <laughs> yeah, because something. Well, uh, yeah, sometimes uh, the people is very. Uh, how do you say terca? Oh, stubborn. Stubborn. No. Are listen, you listen, not... listen, listen. Stubborn. Stubborn. Okay, stubborn. 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 Yeah, it can be terco, necio. Okay, is the same word for necio? Yep. Okay. Okay. Please, Mario, yeah. you are are not a good counselor. <laughs> you don't Why? have you don't have patience. Hello guys. Hi, how are you? Oh I suffer whenever you speak Rosalina. Don't do that. No, I I'm trying to to uh, um speak than other guys but I don't know what happened. Marlo, you around? Yes. <laughs> yes, sure. Okay, Marlo. There's Josue also. Josue, yeah. Yeah, I'm his teacher. He's talking about be patting and, and wow. something, but I, I discovered some, some characteristic to the cons consul. Consular. Consellor, yeah. Yeah, and Rosalina is not a, a good listener, you know. She's always impatient, playing around from place to place. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it's time, guys. 60 seconds. <laughs>
Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, guys, well, before we get into the discussion, let me tell you, uh, today's class is uh, today's class is mostly speaking, actually. No? Let me just check on something on my lesson plan. Just bear with me for a second. Sorry, I'm not testing some slides. Just one second. Okay. Well, let's see. A good counselor, that's something very interesting, right? What's to be a good counselor? How can you be a good counselor? What are some of the characteristics a good counselor might have? Tell me at least two characteristics, Jose Ortiz, please. Okay, no problem, Jose, no problem. I understand. That happens, that happens. So let's see, uh, Antonio Rodas, hello. Nelson Antonio. Well, wow. Uh, Holman. No, I guess you're having serious problems Jose, with the connection. Do something. Turn off the camera. Perhaps that helps. Apague la camera. Tal vez eso le ayude. With the connection. Sometimes it happens. And sometimes it helps turning off, turning off the camera. Okay. Okay, Josué, hello. Hello, yes. Yeah, we can hear you better. Okay, tell me. Uh -huh. Tell me at least two characteristics of a good counselor. Uh, we're talking with the group with our teams and we think the uh, counselor mm -hmm. have to be patient uh-huh. Um, we think he cannot be ex expert, okay. but but he he has to know about the problem. Okay, that's that's actually interesting. And it's a nice point, you know, uh -huh. yeah. Some of your classmates were also discussing a little bit about that. Okay, well, uh, thank you, okay, Mister. Uh, okay. Let's see, Holman, uh, what you got? What do you think? What are some characteristics of a good counselor? Me. Yes, Holman. Uh, I think it's very important to have a good health. Have a good health is important for uh, be a good person. Good health is important to, to help people. A good health. Okay. Excellent. Thank you. Uh, yeah, you got more? Logica y 
Okay, perfect. Uh, I think you're just having the same problem as who said something. Uh, it feels like your connection is unstable. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Carla, what about you? What's your opinion? What are some of the characteristics a good counselor to have? Okay, know how to listen, don't crit, crit, uh, criticize. Criticize the person. Oh, not criticize the person, yeah. Very good point, a nice point, excellent. Yes. Carlos Antonio, what about you? What do you think? I think a good counselor is the one who know how to deal with the different situation when there's a lot of issues or problems, depend the place or depend the situation. That's what I think. And you have to be humble and kind. Okay, depending on the situation, humble and kind. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful words. Humble and kind. Humble, humilde, and kind. Kind can be understood in different ways. Kind can be amable, forgive. Okay. But it also includes, in this context, it could be understood like someone who really cares. Someone who really cares. I think the de verdad le importa. Okay. Okay. It will be on the result like that. Perfect. Thank you very much, Mister. Okay, Magdaleno, I got a question for you. In order to be a good advisor, do you think it is necessary to have a to have shared the same experience? Okay. The question. The question is. If I have a same experience, I have to share with, no, no, with no. other people? To be, to be a good counselor, para ser un buen mm -hmm. consejero, do you think it is necessary to have shared the same experience? ¿Es necesario haber vivido ya la experiencia que la otra persona está viviendo? Okay. <laughs> to give a good advice, para dar un buen consejo. In my opinion, if you don't have lived this situation and if you don't don't have knowledge from other people who are lived uh, this situation you don't have argument to to reply to advice um about this situation and and then um actually you maybe um you maybe don't don't uh, you maybe don't have lived maybe this. maybe you haven't lived maybe you haven't lived the situation but if the case in this case you are you have an experience from other people you have an argument to give an advice if the other people ask to you for advice. This is my opinion. Okay. Interesting point of view. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Ingrid, tell me, is it important to be patient in order to give a good advice? Yes, teacher, it's important because your opinion is bad. <laughs> so you need to be patient in order to, to give advice to people. Okay, nice. Yes. Marlon, what do you think, Marlon? Hi, teacher. Tell me. Do you think it is important to be patient in order to, to give good advice? The experience. The... No, no, to be patient. To be patient. Ser paciente. 
Yes, because it is an important characteristic for the controller. Okay. Oh, thank you. Very interesting. Okay, let me. We got next topic. I told you today we are going to be talking about. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 give me just a second. Okay, guys, let me, I got a beautiful one for you. Two questions. What are some situations that you enjoy? What are some situations that make you stressful? Like, uh, let's see, a situation that I enjoy. Well, hmm. I enjoy watching a movie with my family. That's something I enjoy. I mean, we're watching a movie. Sometimes we go to the movies. That's something very relaxing for me. That's a nice activity for me to do with them. Also, oh, I enjoy reading. Whenever I am stressed or something, and if I have the chance, I take a couple of minutes, start reading a book, and I feel better. And some situations that make me stressful, oh, having meetings. Having meetings to stress me out. That's something that I don't like. And something else that I hate is when people tell me, hey, look, I need to talk to you about something, but I will tell you tomorrow. Man, that killed me. That really killed me. If you need to tell me something, you say it to me in the moment. But if you tell me, look, we will talk tomorrow, man, I get crazy, completely crazy. I don't know, I'm like that. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see, let's see. Those two questions you're going to discuss in your groups, okay? So groups have been recreated, let me check. Perfect. Oh, but before we do that, have I gotten the second attendance? Get on the second assistance? No, right? No, teacher. Okay, guys. Let no, me yet. let me get it. Ingrid Bell, oops, I'm sorry. Carlos Antonio Serrano Aria. Present teacher. Carlos Elivaldo Abrego Marman. Edwin Alberto Rodriguez Lobo. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Gustavo Javier Ramírez Carranza. Ingrid Beatriz, Natalia Palacios Marino. Present teacher. <coughs> Thank you, Carlos Alevaldo. Thank you, Ingrid. <laughs> Ivan Petrovich Guzman Aquino. Holman Saúl Girón Sánchez. Uh, Josué Rodrigo Ortiz Monterrosa. Hi, teacher. Juan Francisco Ayala Montano. Present, teacher. Carla Lizeth García Lemos. Present, teacher. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present teacher. Luis Mario Criollo Guerrero. Present teacher. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present. Nelson Antonio Arrodas Rosales. Present teacher. 
Orlando Francisco Núñez. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Thank you, Oscar. Rosalina Alvarado. Present teacher. Wilma Echesteni Alvarenga. Wilfredo Areval Ortiz. Present Xiomara teacher. Elisa. Thank you, Wilfredo. Xiomar Elizabeth Cisneros Costales. Ivania Chamilet Domínguez Fernández. And Mardon Jonathan Gutierrez Quilón. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. And let's see. You go to the rooms right now. Hello, Wilfredo. Hi, Magdaleno. What's up, man? How are you? Very good. Really, it's nice. Yeah. Hey, Thank Wilfredo. Ah, working like, like every day. That's every day. It's man. What are some situations that you enjoy? Maybe it's your work and your home. Um, in my job, in my work, in my joy of work. Job. Job. In your job. Mi trabajo. Uh, I visit my family. Really, you enjoy to be with my fam with your family. Yeah. And uh, I drive in motorcycle. This really? Is, is correct. Really, me too. Yeah. I really love riding motorcycle. I really love that. It's mm. amazing. I really uh, I like the um, a uh, little on the street. It's mm. really pretty. The, the the views of of there, mm. the tunnel, the five tunnel. It was wonderful. The the last time. What more do you do you enjoy? Mm. Es, es como eh. um, Carlos uh, said first you can do it mm. Is is mad? Uh, I don't know uh, much al, uh, about metal. I I like uh, more punk and punk rock and uh, indie rock alternative. Uh -huh. Mac, um, the metal is is different, but this one. Okay, I, I, she's Metal, okay, what you like? Don't you like Doom? Uh, Francisco have a band of metal. Oh, really? Yes. What's your gen? What's your gen? In general. Just Trash. metal? Trash, Trash metal. metal. Okay, Trash metal. Then, but I don't really know this general. Metal. Uh, uh -huh. the most the most common uh, what sepultura ah, brujería yeah. sepultura yeah <laughs> megadeth you say it's a trash megadeth, yeah, megadeth. Is, a trash. megadeth is trash yes yeah i like symphonic yeah of course i remember it's symphonic Stratovarius. i remember stratovarius yes yeah. stratovarius is a beautiful band it's like the um, 
was I don't uh, remember the name. <laughs> yeah, Lacrimosa was beautiful. Lacrimosa. No, I, I, I don't, I don't like Lacrimosa. Do you like? like oh, French. I don't, I don't comprehend. I, I don't. I'm so sorry for you. You were going to pass the course, but you know. <laughs> he, he just listened a punk. I Why the punk? Is the punk? He oh, doesn't the, know the, that band. The if it's punk, punk. Oh, the Smashing Pumpkins was good. Oh, it's um, it's good. It's good. It's a old school band. Yeah, of it's course. Good. 1979, my favorite song of them. Yeah, it's the best, the best song. Yeah, I remember like, this much. Yeah, yeah, let's see, punk. What else do we have with punk? Oh, uh, well, uh, what was the name of this guy? Chris Rock. The Static X is a punk? No. Yeah, it could be, could be. Oh, so, Actually, so. In my case, I mean, the problem was that I started, uh, actually I started listening to, to to metal, heavy metal, then I went to, to a little bit of trash, then <clears throat> death metal, then black metal. Oh, black metal, yes. Then, <clears throat> then I jump into doom, still doom, oh, you know, yeah. I was listening, I used to listen, I remember when there was Let's see, the most common bands. The most common uh, theatre of tragedy, theatre of the vampire. Uh, what was the name? Ah, oh, Hagar. Hagar is a viking metal. Yeah. I remember uh, Hagar. Some, some. Uh, yeah, but, I, but I'm, yeah, I remember when this group, what's the name of this band, Therion? I used to be from Therion. Therion. It's a symphonic metal. Yeah, I remember when Therion came to El Salvador and oh, lives, yes. lives right. eyes. Five years ago, teacher. No. Well, it's no, I'm talking time. about back in the days. Ah. I'm talking about back in the days. And I remember also when Lives Eyes came. And the lead vocalist was the the lady who retired from Theatre of Tragedy. And I used to love her voice. So I mean, the problem is when we talk about rock, I have I have listened to oh almost what is, this, what is your I, favorite kind of music? What's the favorite? So hard to tell because I mean I love trova. I love all trova, but we need to go mm -hmm. by germs, like uh, I mean in rock i like uh, doom but also i like power because one of my favorite bands ever is uh, made it oh. it's, a, it's, it's a heavy a, metal maiden is heavy metal it's a classic well, it depends 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 the problem with with the bands of of metal is this it's complex because some of them they they play like on the verge of jumping from one germ to another and and lately it's even worse because in a, in an album they got one song in this germ another song in another germ another in another one i mean it has become a little bit complex it's like uh but i can tell you that i like this group uh german group what's the name hmm. Ramstein. Branson. I used to like Lacrimas Profundere. I don't know if you even know about that band. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, with rock, but as I tell you, I mean, I used to go to the concert and everything, but back in the days when I was quite young, I was like 16, 17, I got hooked into metal when I was 13. I started listening to metal when I was 13, actually. So, I mean, and I listened a lot to metal until I was like 21, 20, 21. And then I moved on. Uh, life, you know, I 
I got married at 23, had a family, a job. Life make, made me wander to other lands. That's why, and then I also love Trova, as I told you, I enjoy listening to, to Silvio, to Ote, Sabina is my favorite. And, Silvio, but, Silvio Rodriguez? Yeah. Yes, so, it's a beautiful song. Uh, yeah, and I mean, Guarda Barranco is one of my favorite yes, bands in Central America. Yeah, so I have wandered a lot between German. You got a lot I, of kind of music, yeah, do you listen? Yeah, but, but, and Ingrid hates me for this, I hate reggaeton. Uh, yes. I, yeah, I hate a, that. Yes. I hate that. It's sorrowful. Yeah. yeah. Ingrid is going to get mad at you guys because she loves reggaeton, right, Ingrid? I'm I gone. can hear, I can hear uh, some pop. Yeah, uh, I, yeah, pop is okay. It's, it's a pop. better listen pop than reggaeton. Yeah, of course. Yeah. All the way. Yeah. Let's come back, guys. Let's see, let's see. Everybody's coming back in a few seconds. We are just waiting for them. Let's just give them a couple of minutes. Well, a couple of seconds, actually. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What are some situations that you enjoy? Hmm. Hmm. Wilfredo, tell me one thing that you enjoy doing. Una cosa que usted le gusta hacer. Tell me, Wilfredo. Just one thing, solo una. Sorry, teacher. Uh, visiting my family. Okay, that's something that you enjoy. You feel comfortable when you visit your family. Yes. Oh, that's great. Excellent. Excellent. Let's see. Antonio, how's your connection now? Doing better? Yes, it's better, teacher. Thank you. Okay, tell me. What are some situations that you enjoy? Okay, I was talking with Rosalina. In my case, I told her I enjoy staying uh, alone at home. Okay, that's interesting. Yes, teacher. I I I told. You feel her, like you can relax completely. Yes, completely, teacher. I open. I open all the door, open the window, and I sit there, maybe in, in a hammock or, the, or in a chair near to the table and enjoy a couple of coffee. A cup of coffee. Yes. Okay. Great. Actually, that's something that I enjoy doing too. Nice. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see, let's see. Who else? Orlando Nunez. Hello. 
Yes, teacher. Tell me, what mm -hmm. are some situations that make you feel stressful? Ah, uh, let's see. Could be dry every day. Driving? Driving every day. Interesting. That's something that really stresses you out. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, traffic is crazy, right? Not not only traffic. Sometimes it's the people who are trying to cross the street and they doesn't and they doesn't look. They don't. Them. Thank you. They don't look around them if a car is coming and it's very dangerous for them. Yeah, they don't pay attention. Mm -hmm. Understand you totally. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Okay, let's see. Carlos Antonio, what about you? Tell me what what are some situations that you enjoy doing that you do and you feel like, oh man, it it's cool. It's something that I feel nice doing. Having a good time with my family. That's the oh. That's the best. That are, that, that's the best thing that I enjoy the most. Okay, nice. Thank you for sharing that with us. Yeah. Okay, Marlon, what about you? Tell me something that uh, makes you feel stressful. Marlon, hello. Hi, sorry, teacher. <laughs> no problem. Tell me something that makes you feel stressful. What is it? Uh, the stressful. Yeah, what stress you out? Tell us stress. Or, uh, uh, for example, the situation that stress me out are when I have many things and I can't think which want to start okay when you have a lot to do and you don't you cannot decide where to start okay yes yeah i understand i understand yeah it can be stressful let's see well i got another question a couple of questions guys what is the most stressful job you can think of what is the least Stressful job you can think of. Okay. What is the most stressful job you can think of? What is the most stressful job you can think of? And what is the least stressful job you can think of? ¿Cuál es el que menos consideran ustedes que es estresante? I'll give you one minute to think right here. 60 seconds. Because then I'm going to ask a couple of you directly, okay? You got 60, 60 seconds to think about the most stressful, the less stressful. It starts now, okay? You can take notes if you feel it necessary because you are going to explain to me why. Okay, let's see, Magdalena, tell me what's the job that you think is the most stressful ever? Teacher, I am thinking about that and I don't find what is the most stressful. Every every work, every job are stressful. If you are a teacher, you're stressed. If you are an accountant, you are stressful. 
and you are a pastor, you have a stress, and you are a soldier, you have a stress, and maybe I don't know what is the most stressful. Maybe the teacher who who teach uh, for little little children, the most little children, kindergarten maybe. That's crazy. Yeah, that <laughs> job is very very stressful. <laughs> Yeah. I wouldn't get into that. Never. You ain't no way. That's crazy. I, I think, think that I think that I don't know. Oh, every one of the job are stressful. Okay, interesting point of view. <laughs> Let's see. Thank you, Magdalena. Let's see what uh, Miss Mario. What do you think? What's your opinion? What's the most stressful job in your opinion? Well, teacher, I, I have uh, three years experience work in a call center. And that's crazy. And three years working. Yeah. Working in a call center is the most stressful work. <laughs> now I am not working in a call center and I give really thank you for that. <laughs> I am thankful. I am thankful. I thankful. I am thankful for that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, many calls, uh, call by call. It's a, it's a claim with with the clients, and uh, it's so successful. I work yeah, in and in Claro. So I really and in both situations really, you felt stressed. Yeah, yeah. I don't no regresaría nunca. <laughs> I wouldn't go back. Yeah, I never go back there. Okay, yeah. That's interesting. That's interesting. Let's it's see, you. Carla. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, yeah. We are going to go to the other side right now. Carla, tell me what is the least stressful job you can think of? What is the menos stressante for you? Carla, your microphone. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, eh, cuidar, ¿cómo se dice? Taking care. Take, taking. Uh, children, cuidar Taking niños. care of children, you think that's not stressful? Eso no, no. no. Mm. Interesting. No. Paso jugando. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Whatever. No comment. Sí. You got no kids, sí. right? Usted no tiene hijos, ¿verdad? No. Ah. Pero sí, sobrinos. Aha. Still is not the same. It's not the same. Believe me, believe me. I want to see you with a couple of kids. Le quiero con unos tres o cuatro. And then we talk. Yes, mama. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, that's, I mean, that's a whole different story, my dear. Thank you, Carla. Okay. Okay, let's see. Uh, uh, hmm. Carlos Antonio, what do you think? What is the least stressful job you can think of? Be a mental, a mental health counselor. A mental health counselor. You know, yeah. it's very funny. Uh, actually, they are considered that they undergo a lot of stress. Yeah, because you have to deal with a lot of situation that is not yours. Yeah, I mean, it's complex. It's a very complex. And you have story. to come out with, with advice. And even though you, you don't have, you, you don't thinking about your life, but you have to come out with a good advice for, for your customer, you know? Yeah, sure. That's what I'm thinking. That is okay. in my mind now. Mm -hmm. Nice. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Okay, and one more. Let's see. Luis Abrego, hello. Hello, teacher. What is the most stressful job you can think of? Then I think the most stressful job is working at night. Whenever you got to work nights. <laughs> yes. I do. This is this is it's a de vida. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean. You need to really, really be good at it because working nights is, is stressful. It's a lot of stress. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys. Thank you very much. Now, guys, okay. next set of questions. What is your bigger goal in life? How do you plan to achieve that goal? That's what you're going to ask your classmate. What is your biggest goal in life? How do you plan to achieve that goal? Cambio de tema. ¿Cuál es su, la mayor meta que usted tiene? How do you plan to achieve it? ¿Cómo espera lograrlo? ¿Cómo para alcanzarlo, conseguirlo? Hey guys, you are going to have a couple of minutes for that. Let me get you the question so you can ask an answer. You're going to have five minutes, okay? So you can explain to your class. Groups are open. Oh, 30. Three children. <laughs> no, no, no. No. I don't know. So, you know, I. No, yeah, no. taking care of children. Taking care of children. Oh. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Well, it depends. You really need to like doing that. Realmente es alguien que le guste mucho hacer eso. Because for me, I think it will be one of the most stressful ever. Pero yo cuido a mis sobrinos cuando, cuando me los dejan a mí. No, oh, okay. no siento not... yo que, que me estreso. Solamente que sí tengo que tener cuidado cuando veo que están haciendo algo peligroso. Are you good Pero... at changing pampers? What? Are you good at changing pumpers? Are you any good? Are you any good at changing pumpers? Es buena cambiando pumpers? Cuando estaban chiquitos, sí. Pero ya están grandes, o sea, ya. Man, you're really a good aunt. Qué buena tía tienen. Because, man, my, my nephew, my niece, or <laughs> they make a lot of noise, which is real. So, I mean, little kids are difficult. Es que hay que saber. Porque a mí el ruido sí me, eso me estresa. Escuchar mucho ruido. Really? Oh, man. Yeah. You should Entonces, go to you should go to the school where I work. I got like uh, twenty kids in third grade. Tengo como veinte niños en tercer grado. Beautiful, so beautiful. <laughs> like a concert. <laughs> yeah, that's. I mean, that's beautiful. That's an experience. 
when they fall, when they cut, or when they fight. Oh, yeah, nice experience. I'm out of here. Bye, guys. But, okay. but uh, oh, okay. the opportunity um, sorry I don't know if you connection or my connection is but can you repeat sorry. In the company that I want to, I want to, excuse me, teacher, ¿cómo se dice? Quiero dejar un legado. I want to, <clears throat> teacher is closed there. The microphone, teacher. I want to let a legacy. Okay. In, 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 in one way, in, in my company, improve the company, give some more employees, but in another way, in my job is a, give a legacy for the athletes in our country. There athletes. is a reason for take a job right now. Oh. That is my, my goal. Because always, okay. I say, well, always I work in my company, but right now I talked to you in days ago, I job, I have a job and then I have two ways and then I two biggest golf in my life. At the end, <clears throat> the golf is I will retire. And no, I don't have any problems with the money when I retire. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah. This is yeah. my 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 you know. And yeah. you, Anthony, only oh. only only for your job, you need to. Looking for another job, you say that it's true. Hey, let's see. Connection is giving us problem. Some problem, that's why we stay here. So we can spell so on. Okay, we're just waiting for everybody to be back. Coming in a few seconds.
Well, 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 let's see. Orlando Nunez, tell me, what's your biggest goal in life? My bigger goal in life, uh, I told my, my partner in the group, uh, one of my short-term goals at the moment is to get a job in a call center that will help me to save some money to have my own house and then be able to study so I can have better opportunities and maybe get a job outside the country. Abroad. Abroad. Sorry? Abroad in the extranjero. Oh, okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Very interesting. Yeah. Thank you. Let's see, what about you, uh, Luis Mario? What's your biggest goal in life? Yeah, my, my biggest goal is to be a owner or one or two companies or different business. Um, but I also want to be uh, influential in other people with a with, uh, conference, with uh, maybe courses or, or be a, a, I don't know. Uh, well, that could be uh, one company. Sorry, repeat. That could be one of the companies. Yeah, yeah, it's a good, a good idea. <laughs> that could about... be one of the companies you want to set up, right? Yeah, about professional, no, develop, personal develop, or right? Development, personal development. Develop, personal development, right. Yeah, it's a good idea. <laughs> I really enjoy that. Oh, that's, yeah, it takes a special attitude and skill in order to, to enjoy those things. Yeah. As I was telling you once, oh man, those motivational speech, I hate them. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I mean, it's just that I am very, I am, for those things, I am kind of boring, you know? <laughs> yeah, I understand, but it's funny. It's very, uh, it's very good when you, uh, when you, how do you say lograr? Achieve. Achieve influence influence in, in another people to make something. For example, in a in, in on the gym, when you support someone with the with the weight. Help. 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 Yeah. Help with uh, uh, help another person with the with the weight and and that it's so so amazing to me right. the motivation the motivation right. is everything okay perfect thank you uh, what Thanks. about you Carlos Antonio what is your biggest goal in life to have my own family. Okay. Man, you're not happy as you are. That's so sad. So you're single right now? Yeah, I'm single. Totally. And it's nice being single, but and it's nice having a family, but don't rush it. Don't rush it. Take your time. Thank you. Everything, Magdalena, everything. Yeah, tell me. Everything, everything comes in the right time. I need to be patient. At the right time. At. At the right. Yeah. Yeah, you can say so. You can say so. Magdaleno. Hello, teacher. I'm. I'm asleep. You are falling asleep. Yeah, you are yeah, falling asleep. Falling okay. Asleep. Well, let's do something so you can get better. So tell me about yourself. What is your biggest goal in life? 
Ok. Ok, teacher. I, I want to have my own restaurant. Ok. A biggest, a big, a big restaurant at the, at the beach with a big swimming pool and a big conference room and a big backyard, play, play yard. And I don't know what more. In this place, specifically, you can, uh, you will can, is correct. Oh, you will or you can? Uh, uh, futuro. Ah, you will be able. Okay. Oh, you will be able. <laughs> you will be able to fish, to fish in your own fish to it. Yeah. Yes, it's right. It, it is my dream. So you like cooking? No, I don't like, but I like fish. <laughs> Man, you don't like cooking and you want to own a restaurant. Yes. <laughs> no comments. No comments at all. That's that's uh, oh, bizarre. That's bizarre. <laughs> bizarre. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, for me, it's like... Yes, crazy. But this no, 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 not crazy. Insane? I, no, it's just that uh, when I say that something is uh, bizarre, I'm saying that uh, something is kind of a uh, say extreme. Mm, strange. Bizarre. Uh -huh, bizarre. Uh, <laughs> bizarre is. It's more than it's more than strange. It's more closer strange. to closer to raro. Mm -hmm. It's more strange uh, than strange. Oh, see, it's more strange. Yeah, yeah could be. Well, thank mm -hmm. you, okay. Francisco Ayala. What is your biggest goal in life? Okay, my bigger goals in life is finish my study of the English uh, because I would like a good translator. And I have get it uh, work and very hard in my studies. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Let me do something. <clears throat> okay, guys. Now, uh, uh Today, before I move on, before I continue, I need to tell you something. Uh, today in the in the platform under today's uh, in the platform abajo del video the, the, the video for today is going to be like later because I need to upload it and they put it tomorrow. But by for the video conference number seven. Uh, you got an extra activity. Abajo del, le va a aparecer una actividad extra. Under the video. Abajo del video. Okay? The question is, what is your biggest goal in life? Explain. Eso aparece abajo de la videoconferencia. Okay? Of today. It, yeah, 2.1. Ejercicio 2.1 on the platform. Take notes if you need. I need you to please answer the question. 
What is your biggest goal in life? I need you to type for tap, but I need it for tomorrow, please. And I'm going to be checking the, the, the advances in this activity. Voy a ir revisando los avances de nuestra actividad. Okay? And that's cool because it's an extra practice. Let's see. Francisco, did I ask you already? Sorry, what is your question? What is your biggest goal in life? My biggest goals. Yeah. What is your biggest goal in life? Oh, it's working a call center, mental performance, science, or you know. Okay, working in a call center. I mean, you know, that's one of the jobs that you either love it or hate it. As simple as that. Because if you ask with Mario, he says that he hates that. But I know like... Uh, yeah, I well, confirm. <laughs> Carla does most of her job uh, through phone and she's quite happy. So... It depends a lot on who you are and what are the things that you like, what are the stuff that you really enjoy. Okay, that's that's like mandatory in this in this specific situation. Okay. Let me see. Okay, you got next question. <clears throat> what are your goals? It's the same, but what are your goals but in your current job? Now focus on what you do. Ahora enfocado en sus trabajos. Due to the time, you just got three minutes to discuss. What is your biggest goal in your job? That's the question, okay? Debido a los problemas de conexión, a ver cómo por un momento. <clears throat> yes. And um I like Do you like cobrar? Yes, me gusta. Why? Um eh, eh, ay, que no sé cómo Cómo ponerlo. Eh, the client, 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 client <ríe> eh, the client problem. Eh, eh, resolverle. So. 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 Me entendió. <ríe> no. She enjoys 
helping the client to solve their problems. Ella disfruta el ayudar de los clientes que resuelvan sus problemas. Is that right? Yes. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Listen up. Give me a second, guys. And you, Josue? Um, uh, um, earn more money. Get more money. And man, that's everybody's goal. <laughs> that's all the todos. Um, I mean, money is not happiness, but man, it makes life so easy. Más la felicidad, pero vuelve la vida tan fácil. Sí, sí, sí. It's necessary for a better life. And yo, yeah. Carlos. Yes. Tell me. Um, yeah. What is your goal and your current work? Current work. Maybe to be the, the manager. Okay, to become the manager, to become. Become a manager. In that way, I can be, I can have less job. I don't know, but I less will have work. more. Responsibilities. Yeah, you get more responsibilities. I I know I, I I will take more responsibilities, but at least I will have less how do less you say do. Physic, physic, physical job because I, I, I am a delivery guy. Oh man I, I, I drive and I take it's it's stressful, but I want to be manager. I don't want to go out to I don't wanna go out and drive. Yeah. I want to stay yes. indoor. Okay, interesting. Nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Carla says she doesn't need the money. She just wants to have fun. Carla, I takes it there your phrase. Dijiste su frase. I like helping people to solve their problems, okay? Okay. Okay, guys, it's almost time. Let's go back to the main room. Okay, let's just wait for everybody to be back in 60 seconds. Sorry, Rosalina, I didn't ask you that much because of your pro, okay? Tomorrow, perhaps you are doing better, you can participate more. Okay, thank you, teacher. No problem, no problem. Okay, guys, I'm so sorry that time has flown. Lamento que tiempo voló. When Fred was like, man, I wanted to participate. But don't worry, Wilfredo, tomorrow you will. You will have more chance to participate. Okay, guys, let me get the final attendance, please, because believe it or not, time has come. And I know some of you are very tired, right? Well, I don't know you guys, I am, I am like, uh, almost falling asleep. No, not really, not really, not quite, but yeah. 
Let's see. Uh, Carlos Antonio Serrano Arias. Present teacher. Carlos Elibaldo Abrego Mármol. Thank you, Carlos Elibaldo. Edwin Alberto Rodríguez Lobo. Gabriel Beltrán Pérez. Gustavo Javier Ramírez Carranza. Ingrid Beatriz Natalia Palacios Molina. Ivan Petrovich Guzmán Aquino. Holman Saúl Girón Sánchez. Present. Thank you. Josué Rodrigo Ortiz Monterrosa. Here I am, teacher. Juan Francisco Ayala Montano. Present. Carla Lisset García Lemos. Present. Luis Antonio Abrego Sarabia. Present. Luis Mario Criollo Guerrero. Present, teacher. Magdaleno Escalante Orante. Present. Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present, teacher. Orlando Present. Francisco Núñez. Present, teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. Rosalina Alvarado. Present, teacher. Vilma Yesenia Alvarenga. Wilfredo Arevalo Ortiz. Present, teacher. Good night. Good night, Wilfredo. Chemar Elizabeth Cisneros Rosales. Ivania Chamilet Domínguez Fernández. El Marlon Jonathan Gutiérrez Girón. Present teacher. Thank you. Hey guys, nice class. Very good conversation. See you tomorrow. Have a good one. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Okay, Josue, you stay with me, right? Hello, hello, ¿qué tal, Josue? ¿Cómo estamos? I don't hear you. No, bien, bien. Sí, sí, estaba. Había puesto en silencio. Ok, bien, sí, José. Ok. Usted está trabajando desde su teléfono, ¿verdad? Sí. Ah, para afuera. Sí. Ok, José. Let's see. Le voy a mandar algo. Necesito que este texto que le voy a mandar. Bueno, es una dirección que, que la, la copie, la pegue. También está que le funciona. La puede abrir. En game se consola en un segundo. Esta, ah, va, pero ahorita. Esta, quiero ver. Okay, Josué, let me let me explain to you what what is it about. Then I click on the second part. This is the first exercise that I would like you to do. Bueno, ahí le parece un estado de videos. I need you to check them. Sí, ajá. Necesito que me hagan una extra. 
anyone, cualquiera, doesn't matter, no importa. But look, Ajá, ¿qué? ¿Por I, qué I advise you, yeah, I, I advise you to do one or two per day tops. Yo le recomiendo hacer uno o dos al día, máximo. No more than that, okay? One or two per day. That's going to help you because it, esos ejercicios te van a ayudar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please do not, do not show, do not show, do not show, do not show. Perdón, esto no podemos poner el material de terceros acá en nuestro video. Okay, what I need you to do is to check them, practice them, revístelos, practíquelos, and they are going to help you to get uh, vocabulary. Le van a ayudar a que tenga mejor vocabulario. And you are also going to get acquainted with the culture. También se va a relacionar usted con la cultura. American culture, that's very nice. So, practice them. Listen to them, and if you got any question, let me know. Es una herramienta extra que le puede servir a obtener mejor vocabulario. Got it? Preguntas? Bueno. Sí, 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 este, sí, son, me parece como una buena herramienta para, para mejorar mi vocabulario y, y, y aprender a escuchar también. Ok, let's hope it's helpful for you. Espero que le ayude. Is there something else that you would like me sí. to help you? ¿Hay algo más en lo que le gustaría que le ayudara? Solo, eh, yo no he visto la plataforma. La, hoy, bueno, mañana voy a tener tiempo de revisar. Este dijo que en la actividad número 8 íbamos a, a ponerlo de la meta. Vea. No. Eh, es el ejercicio 2.1. El ejercicio 2.1. Sí, corresponde Ajá. a la videoconferencia número 7. Ah, va. Va. Okay. Abajo del video usted va a encontrar Ajá. lo que yo les he colocado, que es la pregunta: ¿Cuál es tu biggest goal in life? Le aparece un post. Entonces usted le va a dar sobre el post y ahí le va a desplegar la pregunta, el explain, y le va a dar la opción de que usted lea el contexto. Okay. Ah, ok. Perfecto. Ok. See you tomorrow. Nice. Okay. Here. ok. Good night. Bye. Well, the time has gone.
tomorrow. Bye-bye.